everyone, this is Lauren of Makeup by Lauren Ann, and today I'm going to be reviewing the L'Oreal Hip Jelly Bombs, and I own Plush, and Succulent. Alright, so this is the first one I got, and this is what Plush looks like, and as you can see, I have used a lot of it. Um, I've had this for maybe a month, and I just love it. I mean, it goes with everything. It goes great over a lipstick or just used alone, and it's awesome. So, I was debating at the time that I got that one if I should get succulent, and I finally decided to because it's a very nice rosy tint, it's still wearable, and I love this one so much, so why not? So, that's what succulent looks like. These are $10 at Ulta, which is where I got them. Um, you know, they retail for maybe 9 to $12, depending on where you live, where you purchase them, such as Walmart, Target, Walgreens, CVS, things like that. And um, the selection I saw was four different colors. I saw these two, an orange one and a red one. I'm not sure if there's more than that. And, you know, they come in these little glass jars. And apparently, Plush is an exact dupe to a MAC Tender Tone. Um... So, I'm not really sure about that. I don't own any, so don't really ask me specifics, but that's what I've heard. So, um, but anyway, these are well worth the money. They are very conditioning to your lips. They do not feel sticky, and they have a very nice shine. I'm wearing succulent right now, and as you can see, it has a really nice rosy tint, whereas this one would be more shiny than colorful. But these are very worth it because they do, they moisturize your lips, so it's like a a lip balm, except it's like a lip gloss too, so it's a two-in-one, and um, I think that's really great, because if you have chapped lips, you can throw this on, but still have lip gloss on. So, I think it's a really good idea. Um, I use these a lot, and I really like them. I really recommend them, and I honestly have no complaints about these. I mean, the only one that I can think of is if you do not like putting your finger in a jar and then putting it on your lips, you may not like these. But that can easily be fixed. What I do is I carry this around in my purse and then I have a retractable lip brush so it stays clean and it doesn't go all over my other stuff in my purse but um, I don't have to put my finger in there. So that is just an easy way to apply these without getting messy. So really, there's nothing to complain about, and I think these are really, really awesome. And I gotta say, I actually like these more than my MAC Lip Conditioner and the, um, the Kors Lip Butter. So, I recommend them. And if it's a buy one, get one free, buy one, get one half off, even better. So, I hope you enjoyed this review. A lot of people were requesting it, and I knew I was going to do it soon. Um, so, thanks for watching. Rate, comment, favorite, subscribe, and have a terrific day. Bye.